Welcome back to the Lockout Man Podcast Show. <laughs> and in this segment of Breaking Truckers, we're looking at TikToker gear grinding hyena yes uh she has been featured on the lockout men podcast show a few times gear grinding hyena is at the kroger and well let's just say that this was a jackass moment it really was this this clip right here that we about to look at is something straight out of Jack ass. I'm for real. A truck driver came and accosted gear grinding hyena with with obscenities, which you know, which is not it's not appropriate. But uh I guess gear grinding hyena must have got this dude heated. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. What are you going to do about it? Get your white ass out. What? I'm white? Step your ass out. Really? I don't got no respect. I ain't got no respect. You got no respect for me, a fellow truck driver. Really? Okay, bye. This is why you drive a Volvo. This guy wants to kick my ass because... He almost hit me in the parking lot because he cut in line to get out. He cut in line to get out the gate, almost hit me, and I'm the bad guy. <laughs> Go ahead, act like a fool. Let's make you famous, bro. Truck drivers. <laughs> oh my god. Somebody need a diaper change. <laughs> oh my god, you guys don't get paid enough for this fucking bullshit, I swear to god. <laughs> Let's get into this, okay? I just delivered to the Kroger's distribution center in Romulus, Michigan. The way this place is set up is when trucks enter the facility, you either turn left or you go straight, depending on what side of the building your dock is that you're going to deliver to. And then when you're done, you turn around and go back the way that you came, which means both sides converge in an intersection, and trucks are supposed to take turns going through the guard shack. You know, like what they taught you on Sesame Street, taking turns. <laughs> It's my turn to turn. I'm about to turn. He sees my white ass and is like, oh, stop. And he damn near takes off the hood of my fucking truck to keep me from turning. <laughs> Blowing his air horn, which just pissed off the hornet's nest that is the security shack. <laughs> and he got yelled at or whatever. I don't know. But he started throwing a temper tantrum. So I started recording because grown ass man in a Volvo truck throwing a temper tantrum. That's fucking hilarious. And I'm laughing, and he sees me laughing, and he gets a thousand times madder because I'm laughing at him. And then you see what he does, threatening me and shit. The one guard shag worker is like a pit bull having none of this bullshit today, trying to get him to leave. You see the one poking her head out, confused, like, what the fuck is going on? Another one standing next to me just laughing. God damn it, I love this fucking job sometimes. <laughs> Well, what do you guys think, man? Leave your comments in the comments below, man. I mean, as I said before, and I and I will say it again, us truck drivers are the most toxic people that we can ever come across. Some of us are nice, some of us are okay, and some of us is just downright nasty. Now, Whatever whatever situation that made this dr uh, truck driver pop his cork really wasn't necessary to to really go off like that. Bitch. What are you gonna do about it? Get your white ass out. What? I'm I'll white. Step your ass right up. See, what well, people need to understand, and let me and let me tell you this right now, people need to understand that. People is going to record, period. They're going to get their phone out. They're going to record. They're going to put it up on the internet. All right, so what you guys think, man? Let me know in the comments below. Do you think the driver was right? Do you think Gear Grinding Hyena was right? I don't know, man. 
But I'm just glad uh, she was okay and nothing else happened. But as I said before, man, us truck drivers are the most toxic people in the world right now. All right, that's going to do it for this segment of Breaking Truckers on the Lockout Man Podcast. Show.